WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. And currently, have all the U.S. indices that we track trading to the upside. Dow's up 103, S&P 27, Nasdaq 143, the Russell's up seven, semis are 50. Semis leading the charge are up one and seven tenths percent to the upside. Gold's off five bucks, silver down four pennies. Lights recruit up uh, 59 cents. Natural gas is up seven pennies. 30 year treasury is up 26 ticks. She's printed out at 132.16. Let's try to figure out what all that means by taking a look at that nine panel market update chart. We begin in the upper left hand corner. You've got the ES mini. You can see that Gartley buy pattern, the buy the D point pattern that formed out here on the trading day of uh, March the 14th. Completed the A to B equals CD. We've got a Gartley buy. Price is going to likely target the 4,007 level. It will do that for sure, or close to for sure, if we get that spot volatility to get below that 50-day exponential moving average. It is not, and that says that things are still a little dicey. The 50 days at 2138. The spot is printing out at 2407. In the case of the NASDAQ, it says, I don't know what you guys are worried about here. It's trading above the top of its daily profile. It's Gartley buy pattern that formed out here. This is a couple weeks ago. March the 2nd. Today is the 15th. A couple weeks ago, we had a Gartley buy pattern that's formed in the NQ, and sellers have tried and attempted to bust out that pattern, and they have been unsuccessful. And now what we've got is prices trading above the top of its daily profile. Don't know where we'll close today, but a close above 12, 459 will be a bullish outcome. That's going to suggest a move into the swing point from back on February 2nd. If we take a look at what's going on, the U.S. dollar index got back inside its profile yesterday. We just have a consolidation between support and resistance. Support down at the 103.77 area, I believe. I can't find that. Uh, shoot. Um, there we go. Uh, the actual number is 103.77. Resistance 105.49. Goldilocks. Gold has a nice TD9 count and Rhodes Mintum indicator bottom pattern out there. Wish I could move this thing. Oh, by the way, there we go. And uh, it's likely targeting the 1966 to 1975 area. Silver closing above the top of its daily profile. It too wants higher price. We take a look at lights we crude. If we go all the way back, let's just open up this chart here. Nice A to B equals CD pattern. The A point out here all the way back in uh, June of 2022. But it completed the one-to-one -one price projection level yesterday. You can see that by getting down to 6701. So now we're on watch for a bullish reversal candle. Why? If we get that, that says, be long, light sweet crew. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you have to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. Thanks again for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you again soon.